There is one side to MFS that still needs a bit of love, and that's the long haul side of MFS. Short haul's good, medium haul is good, it's just the long haul stuff. It needs a bit of work, you know what I mean? However, we have been getting updates with the, you know, the 787, the 747, but no one's talking about the 321 Neo. Now, if you guys don't know, the 321 Neo can fly across the Atlantic. Oh, say less. We're about to fly out of Boston, and we're going all the way to London Heathrow. Link. I think, well, I think the flight turns around about seven hours-ish, maybe a little bit shorter, I don't know, depending on the winds. But yeah, we're flying as JetBlue Airlines. It's going to be fun. It's going to be wicked. I had a quick look at the weather and it's looking tragic. So yeah, this is going to be fun. Damn, look at that. We. Wow. <laughs> what the hell is an EasyJet dude here in Boston? Me? <laughs> Just hanging around. Batteries, batteries, and stand up our way. Yes, I got it right. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's on there, that's on there too as well. Pretty dark in the flight at though. Turn the lights up in a second here. This early morning departure finna be a vibe. Can we get some lights on here? There we go, mate. And let's get some let's get some lights on here too as well. Lovely jubbly. <sighs> We're going America, so we're gonna use this version of the Q and H. Yuck! Oh! Ew! Dude! What the? Watch your profanity. Golly! Why are the winds like that? Twenty-four gusting thirty-six. Oh, departure is gonna be fun. And um, oh nine fifteen Zulu, ten sixteen Zulu. Okay. We got a ding and um, oh, message. We just got a PDC. One second. Boston Tower PDC, Corsa JetBlue 1620 equipment. We're an Airbus A220. Well, Airbus A. What am I? Airbus A321 Neo. There we go. <laughs> All right, we take flying from Boston. It's the Lipster 7 departure, and I think that's just my routing right here. Yeah, yeah. Climb by the Sid. Expect flight level 350, 10 minutes after departure, frequency 1330 is a zero. It's called 7370. Contact Boston Tower on 128, decimal eight, with location on, on the aircraft. I'm guessing that's my my squawk in it. Yeah, I think so. Current eight system ready for push. Or if you have a question regarding this clearance. Okay. Also you have to request push here. Okay, fair enough. I mean it does make sense because we are very close to the active taxiway. Alright, so it's runway 22 right, and yeah, look at the winds, bro. Ooh, this is gonna be fun and uh, yeah 22 right the uh, what's it called i'm guessing it's called the lipster what's the actual name of this departure um uh, name 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 lbsta i'm guessing it's the lipster the labster top altitude 5000 here so we're gonna get that set in the aircraft uh yeah everything else seems good here where's 22 right actually this aircraft this aircraft sorry this airport seems confusing so yeah it looks like we're gonna go north to the right here taxi via alpha november and then probably cross run away one five right. Not probably. We will cross one way one five right. Continue on November. Is it? Do we cross a runway here, or is it something we can cross? I think we can continue taxiing on him, and all the way to two two right. We'll probably get November one. I request November two just because we're just very very heavy today, like extremely heavy. I think so. Let me have a look. All right. So I'm um, looking over here. So takeaway is going to be eighty nine tons. Max takeaway is ninety three point five. So yeah, we're just a bit below the max takeoff weight here. Landing weight is going to be interesting, but yeah, look at the uh, fuel too as well. Fuel max is 18,500, and uh, yeah, look at that. We, we basically take your max amount of fuel. This is dope. So we got 350 for the first, and uh, 360, then 350. E-tops, all good right there. Custom X, all good right there. Ah, lovely jubbly. Where's my... I was going to say, where's my... Super suit? What? Where is my super suit? Where's my camera crew to tell them they can start boarding? But, um, yeah, you can start boarding now. Where have you guys gone? Huh? Oh, boy, I think someone needs to call the, um... The ground crew, man, you've messed up on your calculations there, mate. Damn. 4787-10? Yeah, someone say say dash 10. I think so. You know, Wesley, it would be really good if you had your live weather on, mate. Stupid. <laughs> I 
153 and 157 and uh, flex today we're gonna go 56 56 for the flex it everything's all set here we're now just waiting for the passengers to finish boarding and then we can request our pushback yes we have to request a pushback in boston i'm so confused because in america you don't really request it usually anyway so it's a bit different i feel like i'm in europe that's not the point of me flying in america oh well Don't care, don't care, still don't care, I don't care. Hello, I'm talking to you mate, everything all good? Oh, just gonna give it a stare, all right mate, you just continue what you're doing, yeah? All right, I'm leaving you to it, sorry mate. Oops. That song's been in my head all day, man. That's such a nice livery, bro, man. I genuinely love it, man. I don't think I, ever, I haven't flown United, have I yet? I might need to give United a little go, man. I love I love that United livery, man. It's, I think it's one of the best liveries out there, man, honestly. I mean, I feel like the Air Canada, the Air Canada Black livery is up there. But this one here, though, top five at least. Top five for sure. And a good afternoon, gents. We just got to speak here from the flight deck. We're just finishing off the paperwork here and we're going to be on our way to London Heathrow. Just some information on our takeoff today. Takeoff is going to be pretty sketchy because the winds are gusting like crazy. And I've never experienced this in a 321 before. So this is going to be fun. I'm just going to stupid fly the flight deck. There we go. Sorry, flight. You're dead. Oops, I didn't mean to say that. Now, as we're finishing off, you're probably going to hear the flight attendant go for the safety demonstrations. And listen carefully to the part when he tells you to like, comment, subscribe, and ding that the notification bell. Because you know what we're going to say now. We're on that road to that silver fly button, baby. 100k, man. We're getting there, man. For you guys all for your support. You should hopefully start a pushback very soon. Thank you very much. And tell your passengers to hurry up too as well, because that's why we're not pushing back. Thank you. I did not turn my AP bleed out on. AP bleed on here. Because the power's out here. Oh, I love that click sound, man. That's so satisfying. Oh. So good. Looks like the cargo doors are closed, which means I'm guessing the cargo's finished. But if I look over here, yep, it is finished. And I think that's, that is boarding completed. Love that. I think we can turn the lights off here. Sun's coming up here. That's all good right there. And that's all good right there too as well. Right. I think we can go request our pushback. I think so. Yeah. Um, where are they? Um, wherever you are, Steve, Susan, whoever you are, it's time for the pushback. Thank you. Where are they? Hmm. Departure Tower, good day. JetBlue 1620 information of every request and start and push. JetBlue 1620, say gate. Uh, gate, Charlie 32. I think so. Simply 1620, pushback onto Alpha approved. Is that what you're Onto Alpha and we're advised. Thank you very much. 1620. Um, I think I know why we can't see the pushback truck. It's invisible. I don't know how this has happened, but yeah, it's invisible. We got parking brakes released. Oh, I forgot to do so many things. Right, that's all good right there. Uh, and let's get you on there too as well, mate. All right, left side is clear. I hope so. Right side is clear too as well. And um, let's go ignition here. And let's go, I think it's number one in the 321. I think so. There you go, number one stop. Good start on the left engine. Oh, jet blue. There she goes. Haha, <laughs> beautiful, man. Right, parking brake can be set. There you go. Pit to ground. We have a good engine start. You can disconnect. Unlocking gear. Oh, they got a new sound with it. Okay, right. I love it. Uh, right, let's get the number two started off here, please. Thank you. Uh, upstairs is all looking good over here. That's all good right there, too, as well. And I was going to do something. Oh, yeah, my squawk. One, so what's my squawk? Seven, three. Um. 7-0. 
Let's get TA over there. There we go. Hey, what's up, Daniel? <laughs> yes, sir. What's good? Oh, I love you when I meet you guys on the day. What's up, Daniel? Daniel? Whoa, sorry. Daniel. JetBlue1487. I think you was the one that just took off there, didn't you? Oh, look at that takeoff there, too, as well. What airline are you? Oh, that's another JetBlue. Oh, lovely. Are oh, you right, mate? Thank you for the hand signal there. Appreciate it. Thank you very much. Uh, right, upstairs looking good here, man. Hey, shout out to Daniel right there, man. What's up, Daniel, man? Apologies, man. I'll start my pushback there. All right, that's a good right tip. Uh, let's get you set here. And uh, let's get you set right there. And uh, all good is on my side. Oops, sorry. We're going to go flaps one and then flaps two. Cabin, can we have you set there? There we go. Camera crew seats for landing. Oh, I keep getting it wrong. Seats for takeoff. I even thought about it and I still got it wrong. What's wrong with me? A JetBlue 1620 request taxi. JetBlue 1620 runway 22 right taxi via Alpha November. Cross runway 15 right hold short on my 15 left. Um, Alpha November across 15 right and hold short 15 left. So, break them at 1620. All right, parking brake is released. Let's get a bit of power, a little bit of juice. And uh, let's not forget the taxi lights now. Yeah, I remembered. Yeah, I'm a pro now. I remembered. There you go. We're moving. Oh, wait, we are moving in a 321, baby. One thing we have to remember to as well is that the 321 is a lot longer than the 320. So we don't want to make that mistake and just go too quickly, if that makes sense. Fingers, fingers crossed we don't do anything like that, man. Fingers crossed. Sixteen twenty cross oh. runway one five left. Uh, cross runway one five left. Sixteen twenty. Uh, I don't know if you noticed, but um, I can now like roll my head left and right. And it feels my tracker feels a lot smoother now. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but I really like you, man. Really, I really do like it. I think it's helped a lot there, actually. I'm guessing. I'll just bit my tongue. <laughs> As I was gonna say, I'm guessing this is an active runway. Uh, yeah, wow, this approach would be amazing. One five left. Wow. I'm trying to think now. I don't think I've ever departed out of Boston. I always flying to Boston, so this is kind of a first here. I love it. Right. Uh, everything else is all good on my side. You know what? Um, have you set like this? Oh. There you go. Um, good for take of two two right. Uh, sixteen twenty. Oh, right. Okay. Wasn't expecting it. Oh, yeah. I forgot. Let's not forget, guys. It's Gustin. So, um, yeah, that's going to be interesting. All right. Let's get lights on here. Lights on here. And you on there. You on there, too, as well. Oh, it's busy, though, in Boston, man. I love it. I love it when it's busy, man. 50%. Here we go. Oh, I'm really nervous here. There you go. 50%. Looking good. And... Man flex. SRS. Runway. Auto... No runway. Sorry, I'm capping. Auto first. It's just blue. There we go. Here we go, man. Ooh, you can feel the winds already. I'm fighting. Gym day, baby. Yes, sir. Leg day. Guys. Oh, my gosh. I'm, I'm like full left on my rudders. Oh, man, oh. oh my gosh, I'm like full left. Um, 100 knots ages ago. Yep. Whoa, bro, I'm like full left on my rudders. Whoa. Oh, this is the end of the runway. This is the end of the runway. V1. Rotate. to climb gear is going up now that's what you call a departure mate yes sir <laughs> that was incredible 2096 the emergency triple wait for you yo that was a crazy departure right uh let's go first climb climb now uh, let's get rid of the lights here. I've already got, I've already got departure on uh, on standby on the frequency. So when he tells us to go there, we're gonna go there. Right? Let's go flaps one here. Departure. Departure. Appreciate. 
Uh, there you go. Is that departure? Yeah. Any departure, good day. JetBlue 1620 passing uh, 2500. Triple 1620 Boston departure radar contact, comma maintain 1414,000. 1414,000, 1621. Sorry, 1620. 1414,000. What the hell is that? I'm just going to guess it told me 14,000 feet. Are you Americans, man? You got problems with the way you pronounce things, man. What's wrong with you? Right, let's go to pilot in here. Oh, wow. That was crazy. Wow. Three, expect the ILS from like 27. 2963 ILS 27, 3492. Our 653 Q0 contact Boston, tower 128.8. 128 for Q0, thank you. Jetble 1620, contact Boston, center 134.7. Uh, 134.7, uh, Jetble 1620. Boston Center? Haha, <laughs> I can finally say it. Boston Center? <laughs> Did a great job. Boston Center, good day. JetBlue 1620, uh, level 14,000. JetBlue 1620, Boston Center, hello. Climate maintained, flight level 350. 350, 1620. Right, you know what? I'm actually surprised. It's actually pretty simple today, man. I don't know why. I think I just... I put a lot of pressure myself because I'm just... I'm low-key kind of... a little bit terrified of America because America is just like so fast-paced. But, um... It's not so bad today. I'm actually pretty happy, man. And I think you can see the sun. What a view. That is what I'm talking about, man. Wow. Did I not decide my spoilers? There you go. <laughs> it's on the spoilers here. See about signs. All right, past 18,000 here. Simba signs off it as well. I learned from you Americans. You guys were on my case when I turned my Simba signs off at 10,000. He was like, no, we in America. We turned them off at 18,000. So I've listened today. There you go. As you can see, we passed 18,000 feet. Simba signs are off. Happy days. Top of 317, wind, but 33026, come 38. Good luck. 320 and uh, thank you for <laughs> Yo, I'm no honestly. If you are flying out of Boston today, bro, good luck landing there. Takeoff was sketchy, bro. Imagine landing there. Ah, oh, hell no. <laughs> I'm in danger. I don't know. Are my eyes deceiving me, or is this? Couple of sixteen twenty leaving oh. airspace shortly. Boston and Montreal are both offline. But our services have terminated. Frequency changes to approved. Connect. Approved. Uh, thank you much. Uh, sixteen twenty. That did not make sense, but. Yep, he understood what I meant there. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Now it's just us and not much ATC. Well, apparently, if I have a quick look. I was about to say we have ATC, but we don't have ATC. That's good on my part because I'm going to take a quick nap. And uh, hopefully we wake up and we've not crashed at all. And we're still in the air. We do a quick fuel check. And once we're done with that, go back to sleep again. And that'll be the final time I wake up and uh, we can land at Heathrow. Yeah. Why did I do that? Don't ever do that again, Wesley. I'm sorry, man. I didn't mean to do that. It's all right, bro. Don't worry about it. Why am I talking to myself? What's wrong? Stop. 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 Well... As you can see, ladies and gentlemen, I'm still awake. Over there is where I, I tried to have a nap, but you know when there ones where you just can't sleep? Yeah. I don't know why. I was just paranoid. I was thinking we're not going to have enough fuel. However, I think we can climb higher. We can't climb higher just yet. Stupid. We've been here for how long now? Um, An hour and 40 minutes. Oh, damn. So we've got... Oh, maths. Five. Four hours and 50 minutes. 
What's the wind looking like too as well, man? I feel we've got some good... Woo-hoo-hoo! 96 in that town wind, baby. Yes, sir. I love me that, man. I love me that. And the weather's cleared up too as well, man. So, the views right now, I'm viewing. I'm liking it. Yes, sir. And uh, good afternoon, gentlemen. You can't speak. You're from the flight deck. We are about to cross the Atlantic very, very soon. Looking at the watch right now, we should be landing at London Heathrow in approximately 4 hours and 50 minutes. So enjoy the rest of this flight. Sit back, relax. Enjoy the snacks, because that's all we've got on board here, because we can't afford dinner. Thank you very much. When you see this, you know your boy has just woken up. I can't lie to you. That was a very, very good nap. I don't know where we are, though, but um, I think... Yeah, I think we're actually coming to the end of our nap track. So, I was meant to check it midway through the nap track, but the nap was that good that um, we're near the end. We're about to enter, I was going to say United of the Kingdoms, but technically it's Ireland. Then after Ireland, United of the Kingdoms. But, while we're here, let's double check on our fuel. So, Heathrow, we need to have around about 3.2. Wow. Okay, uh, we're going to have 5.3, so that's kind of worked out in our favor. Without a cruise natural flight of 360, we did step climb because, you know, the less fuel, the higher we can climb. You know what I mean? The lighter we hit, the, le the less air resistance, the quicker we get to our destination. But I don't know what's happened, but my Kronos has, like, disappeared for some reason. I don't know if it's just a lag in my sim and it's just disconnected because it's happened before, but apart from that, everything else seems good here. We're going to let the aircraft fly for a little bit and then, fingers crossed... Uh, we make it to Heathrow safe and sound. I hope so anyways. Ladies and gentlemen, please stand for our national anthem. And good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is Ken speaking from the flight deck. We're now over the United of the Kingdoms. You probably can't see me because there's a lot of clouds below us, but I promise you, we are over the United of the Kingdoms. Well, technically, Wales, but shh. United of the Kingdoms, okay? So we're going to be descending in approximately 50 minutes and when we're on the descent here, according to our weather charts, the weather's going to be pretty interesting once we reach Heathrow. We haven't crossed winds up to 11 knots, uh, so yeah, it's going to be a windy approach into Heathrow, so make sure. And his seabat sign is on, you have your seabats on, okay? Now for the legends on board today, I want you to come and minty. Thank you much for flying with JetBlue. Should be Heathrow very soon. My goodness, look at the weather though. Oh my gosh, and uh, we've got a contact from who? London Control on one two seven decimal one. A little control. Good day, uh, JetBlue sixteen twenty Nurgle one hotel arrival. JetBlue one six two zero London. Good morning. Don't have your flight plan there. Can you just resubmit for me? Apologies, we get that sorted. Stupid. And file the flight plan. Yeah, we just refiled for JetBlue one six two zero. JetBlue one six two zero. Thank you. Squawk seven three seven zero. 7370-1620 I just confirm you're the uh, Nugra 1 Hotel Yes, Nugra 1 Hotel as well Roger 7370, winds are 210 at 15 knots Boy, alright, QNH is, and it's variable too as well, yeah Was oh, it overcast? Overcast! Oh my gosh Temperature 19, QNH 1000 Alright, 1000 and 19 I was at 210 at 15. And uh, we have got barrel at, which is going to be 277. So, Jeffrey cat 2. 1620, defend flight level 150 to be level at Soppet. 150, level at Soppet, uh, 1620. But where is Soppet actually? Uh, Soppet's over there. Okay, that's fine. So, that's actually following our arrival. Perfect to a T here. And I think, and if I look over here, yes, that's the United of the Kingdoms down below, man. Oh, this is class, man. Sorry, good morning, even. Lovely, thanks for that. Going to 12945 for the channel change. Have a good day. You too. Eurowinds 1 Alpha Tangle claims flight level 330. 12945 is the next frequency. Jetly 1620, descend flight level 90 level, Bobbington. 
Nine zero level Bobbington, uh, sixteen twenty. Nine zero. Um, Ice detected. Yes, sir. Let me turn you on, boy. <laughs> hey. Uh, yep. And uh, let's have you set to ignition. Yep. If I see Ice detected, I'm making sure every anti air sun is on ASAP. That's my fault, though. I should have had it on because we are below. Uh, so the air temperature is below zero degrees here. So. Is it 10 degrees or 0 degrees when I have anti ice on? Hey, look at that right there. You can see that, like, the rain on the windscreen. Crazy. JetBlue 1620, uh, report to your cleared level to London 129.425. Good morning. Report our cleared uh, flight level to London Control 129, decimal 45, appreciate it, 1620. Control, good day, JetBlue 1620, we've been cleared to flight level 90. JetBlue 1620, London Control, hello, leave Bobbington, heading 120 degrees. Leave Bobbington, heading 120 degrees, 1620. JetBlue 1620, descent flight level 80, landing 27 left. 80, landing 27 left, uh, JetBlue 1620. I need to stop saying 1620 out of my head. I need to get out of my head. I'm not in America no more. I have a feeling he's going to bring me in early, you know. I have a feeling. Right, we're 10,000 feet. Uh, and lights on here. See what sounds already on there too as well. Oh, we're getting close to Heathrow, baby. I love when we have 88 Heathrow, you know. I love it, man. I love it. Jet Blue 1620. Descent to altitude 4,000 feet. QNH 1,000. Take Pascal. 4,000. QNH 1,000. Jet Blue 1620. I got the wrong button. <laughs> Jet Blue 1620, speed 220 knots. 220 knots, 1620. Uh, yep, it's busy. <laughs> if we get speed restrictions this high up, yeah, it is busy in Heathrow. Yes, sir. I love it when it's busy, man. Yeah. Right, um, at that point, I want, I'll probably start introducing my uh, flaps now. So, um, you know what? Performance here, activate approach phase. Since you're telling us to go below green dot speed, we might as well. Jet Blue 1620, turn right heading 180 degrees. Uh, 180 degrees, uh, JetBlue 1620. All right, 180 degrees. Oh, I love vectors, bro. We're turning, baby. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. This is amazing, man. Look at this. Is that the city of London in front of us? <laughs> I love it, man. I love it. I love it. London City should be nearby. Is that it right there? I think that's London City over here, you know. I think so. JetBlue 1620, speed 180 knots. 180 knots, 160. Oh, yeah. 598, climb flight level 180. 180 knots here, and let's start introducing the flaps here, speed check. Flaps one. JetBlue 1620, turn right heading 240 degrees. When established, low prize of 27 left, descend with a glide path. 240 degrees when established on a localized, sorry, on a localized, uh, descend with a glide path, uh, 1620. Yeah, the I don't know what I said that I just remixed. <laughs> JetBlue 1620, speed 160 knots, maintain 4 DME. 160 knots, 4 DME, JetBlue 1620. Ah, oh, man, we're above the glides. This is not what you want, man. Right, uh, I think 1,000 feet per minute should be fine. There we go, localizer captured here. Approach mode now, I'm tier 2, so should be glide stop. Yes, sir. Right. I can relax a little bit now. All right, 10D me out here. Upstairs looking Gucci. We're going to still keep the anti-ice on here. Ah, oh, what a view coming into um, London, man. What a view, man. Right, uh, should we go gear down? Right, speed check. Should we go gear down? 10 D me out? Yeah. No, let's go gear down. Oh my gosh, look at the cross we've got going over here. Right, flats free here. <laughs> 14 knot crosswind, baby. My goodness. Runway 27 left, clear to land. The surface wind is uh, 210 degrees, 17 knots, gusting 27. Um, all right, clear to land 27 left, uh, JetBlue 1620. Okay, Gustin. Yeah, my boy. <laughs> 
Yeah, my boy. Yeah, let me go over here real quick. Uh, let me change this to 144. Uh, is it 146? Yep. Yeah. And uh, let's arm the spoilers here. Yes, sir. And let's go full flaps. 5D me out here. And let's go man speed here. And a cabin. There we go. Kevin Crew sits for landing, please, people. Thank you. Oh, my. I'm not. This is. Bro, are you seeing what I'm seeing right now? Look at the crap we got going over here. Wait, this is ridiculous. All right. Aircraft is mine. I think we might have a go around, you know. I smell a go around. She, look at the crab, boy. <laughs> I love it. Mate, I've not had a crab like this in a minute. This is what I'm talking about, man. Ah, oh, I love flight soon, bro. I love it, man. I, I love it. Woo, relax, Wesley, mate. Relax, lad. Relax. Man, these winds, bro. She's Louise. Smell a go around. Smell a go around. Please no go around here, Wesley, lad. Calm down, man. Calm down. You might get down. It gets down. Oh, buddy. Yeah, buddy. This is going to be... I smell a slammer, bro. I'd rather slam it. Then try and get greaser with these kind of winds, bro. My gosh, am I fighting with this uh, side stick right now? 400 here, baby. Let's go. Remember, where's he kick out the crab over the piano tiles? All right. Look outside now. Down the runway we go. There we go. Minimum. Continue. Whoa, okay. 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 50, 40, Whoa. 30, 20. Get it out. Get it out. Get it out. Get it out. Come on. Five. Get it out. There you go. And spoilers. Oh. Alright, calm down, mate. Woo, oh, spoilers. Versus a green. Grand diesel, lay gentlemen. Oh my god, I'm going full right in. The aircraft ain't doing anything. Hey, gentlemen, welcome down to Heathrow, man. My goodness, that was crazy, right? The K to left here. Oh my goodness, bro. That was scary. Jet Blue 160, first right on Alpha. First right on Alpha, 1620. Why do I say 1620? My bad. I'm not meant to say that. Right. Oh my gosh. Anybody that's landing, yo, that was scary. All right, let's turn you guys off here. Don't need you no more. Uh, landing lights off here. Yeah, that's off there. Chevrolet 160, taxi by Alpha and Kilo, stand 217. Alpha, Kilo, stand 217, uh, Jet 1620. all up over here let's get uh one two three four five let's get set there too as well there we go and that is always oh, a nice 787 at heathrow nice uh shout out to mario man that uh what was it yeah mario man sorry i, did, I couldn't reply quickly man i was landing so i uh, listened up appreciate the support man thank you so much man <laughs> this is sick man I love when you guys recognize your boy, man. It's so lit. It's crazy, though, but I'll be honest. It's crazy. Right, Kilo is just to my left over here. Slow this puppy down. You know what he was on that landing was? I, why I kind of just let the flare continue. I remembered I was in a 321. And I was like, you know what? If I fly anymore, I'm going to tail strike here. So I just let the aircraft kind of float in. We got it down, though. Uh, two minutes. I should have gone around. I'll be real. Should have gone around. But it's fine. All right. So that's 28 left. 218, I believe. No, that's 220. 219. Uh, oh, that's an aircraft taking off in front of me. That's 28 left. 
And that's uh, two, one, eight, right, okay. Is this 217 now? Yes, 217, right, slow you down here. Uh, right, Let's make this left turn here. There we go. Uh, let's turn taxi lights off here. It's not blind anybody on the ground here, even though I don't see anybody here, but all right. There we go. Oh, oh dear. What kind of turn was that? My bad. I forgot I'm in the 321, not in the 320. There we go. Let's move you to the right a teeny bit. Apparently, to the right. To the left, to the left. To the left, to the left, to the left. Alright, keep it there. Right, there we go. And that was actually pretty good, actually. And parking brake is set here. APU is now on the bleeds. And that's all good upstairs. Everything is all good. That's all good right there. So then we're going to go engine number... Well, get you off there too as well. We're going to go engine number one. And number two. Right, uh, oh, it would have been great if I turned my strobe lights off here and beacon lights can be off here and seat butt size is off. And there you go. Ba ba da bing, ba da boom. And we can turn you off there, off, off. Everything else is all good upstairs here. Everything else is all good on my side. Uh, let's get 2000 in the box here. 2000 in the box, baby. There we go. Everything else is all good. Oh, my radar, let's turn you off there. Even though you don't work, but let me turn you off. Right. Let me try again. Let me turn you off. Uh, that's off right there. And off right there. Off right there. And um, yeah, you can now start deboarding whoever. You Actually, I forgot. Uh, let me click this here first. Hey, camera crew, open the doors and let the people go. You can now start deboarding. Thank you. Long is this going to take? And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. The boarding has started. We're down here at Heathrow in a 321 meal. I don't know why. It's just, it's weird. Depend, looking how far we were. We was all the way in Boston. And we're here at Heathrow, man. We had vectors coming in. It was a windy landing. The crab was incredible. Oh, man, everything's all good about that, man. I enjoyed that so much. If you guys enjoyed it, be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget, guys. God bless you, man. Jesus loves you. Deuces. <laughs> that was sick, bro.